Salut tout le monde, c'est Gab Morrison, chaque mon gazette K. How are you, bro? All good, bro, man, all good. Shout out France, bro. Premièrement, on est où en fait? We're in Hamilton right now. Like at my house, you know what I'm saying? This is where I spent most of my childhood, you know what I'm saying? That place over there. Before all the music, I used to play football in it. And then after football didn't go to plan, got into music. A lot of people around me making music. So for me, I went in that direction. Go clear out now. <laughs> all digital platforms, go get a listen. On the channel of uh, Gram Daily? Yes, yeah, on Gram Daily, you know what I'm saying? Two weeks now. Hopefully I'm dropping another one in the next two weeks. You get me freestyle coming out soon as well. Listen, I'm trying to go clear, no VVS, got a stack more P, I don't need no rest, go focus on you, this ain't no contest, I know I got me, ain't got me no stress, came on my show, not talking no nest, spreading my wings and now I invest, make the right moves, my life be like chess, if it ain't about money, move like I'm dead. My name's ZK, I've only made one song so far in my career, called Go Clear, like I just said, music has always been around me, it's always been around me, my sister, she sings, amazing singer, my brother, DJs make beats, you know what I'm saying? I've always played football. Everyone in my hood knows me for playing football. Obviously, I went to uni, etc. Got caught up in some stuff over there. But I met some good people that made music over there. So now, alhamdulillah, I released my first first song, Go Clear, Grime Daily, check it out. I'm trying to keep it rolling now. Get the ball rolling and keep it rolling. Release more music for everyone to hear, you know what I'm saying? Real shit. Everything I'm talking about is real. I don't come from the best area. Big up Homerton. Homerton's already been bigged up. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of talented art artists in Homerton. Took my first step, go clear out now. But next, I've got some more to come. So it was your block, this one? This is not the block that ah. I've lived at. I live a few, down, few roads down. But for me, this is where I basically grew up. I was here every single day after school. Like my school's not too far away. But every time after school, I'd come with my boys. We'll come to this place just over here. It's called The Cage. Every single evening, no doubt, me and my boys will go in here, we'll have a kick around, you know what I'm saying? Because we love football, innit? Everyone, everyone I was around always loved football. A couple of my boys, they play professional, you know what I'm saying? But majority, living their day-to-day -day life as usual. It's not an easy place, you know? Playing football, slim chances, you know what I'm saying? Now I'm focusing on music. Music to me is more than just fun now, for me. It's more like, it's like therapeutic to me. It's like, I take my mind off of everything when I'm starting to, to write. Like, I, I go studio two, three days a week. I've got a good team around me now. Yeah, man, this is where basically, this is, this is the groundwork for me, innit? This is, I, I this saw is the hood. The goals are smaller than in France. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, the goals aren't, 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 aren't the best goals, but this is what we have to deal with, you know what I'm saying? This is not the best, <laughs> but obviously, as you see, like everywhere, there's a goal over there, goal over there. It's different, it's different. Because the goals are more... more They're more taller uh, yeah, and, more and tall, slimmer. More tall, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Now, this is just one pitch. Obviously, there's so many places I used to play football in there. We're going to go to a few places. I'm going to show you. Um, there's a place like two minutes away where we're going to go. It's another place that I used to go. There's a youth club there. Shout out to them. Right now, this is where we started. You know what I'm saying? This is just the start. I'm gonna take you around to the next places and we'll see how it goes in it. There are some professional players who come from Homerton. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a few professional players that come from Homerton. Danielson Carvalho, Daniel Smith. There's quite a few. There's a lot of people that's actually made it to that level. But in, when you're at that level in football, it's not very easy to break through to first team. When you're from a place like this, there's a lot of like shit going on around you, innit? it? And it's very hard to keep your focus. To speak for myself, that's basically what happened with me. But, um, I'm happy I got a degree out of everything that I've done in it, you know what I'm saying? Right now I'm just focusing on my music, grinding, making money. I'm, right now I'm independent, solo. I've obviously, like I said, I've got a team, but we work together, you know what I'm saying? It's, like, it's not really a thing whereby there's, there's cuts and all of that stuff. How was your, your childhood here, here in Hamilton? So, childhood here, I'll be honest with you, like I said, it was associated a lot with football. I like, play a lot of football. Obviously, that was like for fun. But when we're a child, like we're immature, like we got, we used to be cheeky in it. Like when we used to come here, we used to do the same thing I'm doing now. Just wait till someone comes. You know what I'm saying? When they open the door, go up there, start throwing some bullshit down or something. You know what I'm saying? Playing games and all of that stuff. I was away from Homerton for around three years when I went to uni. I went to university in Kent. I wasn't here for too long, so now I'm back here to actually see it, stand here and see it. It's like raw, man. This is where everything went down as a child, isn't it? You know now, what I'm nowadays, 
the, the hood is different than back in the days. The hood's always going to be the hood, bro, man. It's, there's always fucked up shit going on in the hood, bro. Trust me. Obviously, it's quite normalised, isn't it? You know what I'm saying? Obviously, to me, drill, it's, it's not really a thing where bad people's saying the mad thing, innit? Doing the mad thing, whatever. It's like, they're just trying to make it out, innit? At the end of the day, bro. It's like, they're speaking about their reality, the, the actual livelihood, what they get up to, and the challenges that they face on a day-to-day -day basis, you know what I'm saying? Fortunately for me, I never, I never got caught up too much. I, I always keep myself to myself. I try to make sure that all I'm doing is providing for the people around me, innit? Yeah, man, this is, this is, this is, this is the block, man. This is the block. We're gonna go up and see what it's looking like. Get a good view of Hamilton, you know what I'm saying? Nice little view of Hamilton. <laughs> it's not gonna be the best view, bro, but you know what I'm saying? It's gonna look alright, man. It's just seventh floor. Seventh floor, bro. You know what I'm saying? This is the top floor. So everything, everything of this is a uh, Hamilton. Yeah, this is all Hamilton. I live more towards those sides. All you can see is blocks, like block of flats. So if you just look from over there, obviously those are new blocks over there that you can see yeah, on the yeah. left. Predominantly, all you see is blocks, like there's just hella blocks. And in every single block, there's like little groups, you know what I'm saying? It's just how it always is in every hood, really, bro. But it's like everywhere you go, bro, it's the hood, innit? Like this is, this is how we grew up, bro. But everyone here knows each other, innit? Like I, I, know, I know a lot of people here like, like I said, they know me for football and school, whatever. Obviously, I'm making my name in music now. I'm trying to make my name in music. I've been receiving a lot of support and a lot of love, which I appreciate from all the people that knew me from football. This, this is it, bro. You know what I'm saying? Are, are, you, are you still playing football? I still play football, yeah, bro. But obviously, five asides. You know what I'm saying? Five or seven asides. Seven aside most, innit? I love football, innit, bro? You know, that's it, bro. I, since young, I've played football. Now, I've cut down, focused more on music, focusing on work and making some money to invest into myself and then build my career you know that's what i'm trying to do bro this is a part of the hood where there are all the shops and everything, yeah this no? is this is like the in homer and this is like one of the it's not the high high street because it's homer and high street but on homer and high street there's like the hospital and stuff but this is where i'm from i'm from near well street so this is well street this is where obviously all the shops are like pizza shop chicken and chip shop uh, fucking supermarket. We'll have a little walk down, innit? This is this is my bus, man. This is the shop that I go to <laughs> every day to get my, my snacks, you know what I'm saying? To, obviously, I don't know in France if you know about a Magnum. It's like a drink that we drink around here. Probably do you know about it. Do you know about it? A Magnum? Mm, have you ever never, heard of it? I never heard. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show nah, you. Show me, show me, show me. This is what they call a Magnum. Oh, what is this? This is a Magnum. This is this is the drink that you need if you, if you want to feel good. Magnum, you know what I'm saying? Oh, we are different. Dig a D, uh, dig a D shot at that one out, you know what I'm saying? But <laughs> Magnum's it's, the one. It's Jamaican? Yeah, it's Jamaican. It's like tonic wine, isn't it? But they say it's good for you, you know. <laughs> See, he knows what he's talking about. <laughs> Cheers, boss. So, we're in the good spot to, to talk about this. Yeah. But in France, you know, in the hood. We, we eat like a kebab, tacos, kebab, everything kebab. of this and in England, what yeah. people eat? Caf. So breakfast, you go yeah. caf, you get English breakfast, you get me? Oh, but okay, okay, okay. Obviously, I'm, I, I don't eat all of that pork stuff. I'm a halal brother, you get me? So me, I make sure that I'm eating uh, either beef, chicken, you know, halal. No pork, no pork, stuff for love, bro. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> but obviously, this is Wall Street ahead of us. I'm here every day, bro, you get what I'm saying? This is, this is where I'm at, man. Where is the best spot to eat? In the best spot to eat is not you're not gonna find it here this is the hood bro you get what i'm saying <laughs> there's like for me obviously a tradition uh, traditional food in, in 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 london like the uk is fish and chips innit? it like you know fish and chips yeah 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 obviously fish and chip shop it's the local fish and chip shop jamaican shop you know what i'm saying it's like multicultural innit? it there's like it's not just all the same shit like there's jamaican there's chinese right there the barber so you get your hair haircut you know what i'm saying yeah, it's a very multicultural place yeah 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 very multicultural very multicultural so obviously that's the fish and chip shop that i always go to as well it's closed right now but there's another one just a bit down there so that's the block some more blocks i was going to take you to those blocks but we might go back there you know what i'm saying just going to walk up this area right here omerton is also famous for famous rappers who come from here yeah 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so there's unknown T, props to him, he's done his done his thing bro. KO, V9, 
obviously B Young, he's actually from here as well. So a lot of people that's actually from Hackney, obviously I'm, I'm from Homerton, but generalizing Hackney is where majority of artists actually come from, you know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of artists come from, come from Hackney. Off the top of my head, I probably can't even say, but I know that a lot of people have come through Homerton, you know what I'm saying? Hackney in general. It's like always been like music based anyway. Like everyone's involved in music one way or another. But this here, Go Clear, this is the shop that I've done my first shot in. So this is my first shot. I was in here. Boss man, boss, man sort, boss man sorted me out on that day, you know what I'm saying? Had to grab a Magnum. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Obviously more blocks, more blocks. More blocks Obviously, yeah. since the Olympics, bro, mm -hmm. it's quite a while ago now, 10 years. Obviously, this was a shithole, like, this was fucked. Really? Like, Hackney Wick, Homerton, it was dead, bro. Obviously, as you can see, there's actually a lot of new blocks that's being made here. Like, from the shot that you got seeing over Homerton, there's a lot of blocks, but they're like new blocks, innit? It's developing as well at the same time. And the, people, the people who live here, they yeah. change too? Yeah, 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 the people change. Uh, I mean, I mean, yeah, no, it's, it's a lot more multicultural. That's, that's yeah. what I would say, innit? It's like a lot more multicultural, which is, which is good, innit? Generally, I feel like the hood's always going to be the hood, like I said. It's like there's always going to be the so-called bad guys, whatnot. The people that think they're the good guys. But everyone lives their own life, you get what I'm saying? Like, can't judge no one on what they do in their life. But this is Tesco. This is the main supermarket in the United Kingdom. But that's another fish and chip shop traditional fish and chips that chicken and chip shop no <laughs> don't do it if you ever come home and don't do it Trust, I, he ask him <laughs> ask him he knows we're gonna go to the park now to our park commons that's where a lot of my life was based as well because obviously like i said i kick ball a lot i used to kick ball every single day so i can't even compare that to to, to music I'm, I'm aiming to get to that stage where i go to studio every single day but obviously right now i'm trying to fund my career you know what i'm saying it's not easy it's quite expensive. If you make music, shit not cheap, bro. Shit not cheap. So, you gotta keep grinding, keep, keep working, you know what I'm saying? And bit by bit, build the bricks. But, um, this is the famous um, British Red Bus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> very, very famous. It's not, it's not the same as the old ones, though, man. They changed, they changed it now, man. Yeah, this is the hood, man. This, obviously, these are all, all the nice houses. These houses are quite expensive now. These are, like, all the, the housing areas. Like, we've moved kind of away from all the blocks. I wanna go this way, you can go this way. So like this is like generally like some nice houses in Homerton. Probably the most expensive houses because yeah, yeah. it's right next to the park in like two, two, three minutes. Little walk will be at the park. So this is the park. This is Victoria Park Commons. You know what I'm saying? This is uh, very well known. You know what I'm saying? In the ends, a lot of people come here, chill. When I have the time, come here, put my headphones on. Or else a zoo, you know what I'm saying? Start writing. When we walk a bit down there, you see something, it's mm -hmm. like, it's not a goal, it's not a football goal, it's not an actual football goal, but I used to use it as a goal, innit? Oh, and that's where yeah, I used to yeah, practice yeah. all my free kicks. Right here. I used okay. to practice all my free kicks over there. <laughs> I was a free kick specialist still. <laughs> I can't lie. I used to love, I used to love taking free kicks and stuff, but this is the small part of the big park. There's a massive park over there called really? Victoria Park. Yeah. Oh. That's massive, bro. That's massive. But it's like half of it's in Homerton, and like half of it's like if you go on the other side of the park, you're basically a mile end. So which, which block is it you told me? So, Homer and B, obviously unknown to you put Homer on the map. This is where he recorded his video. I it was you know just here. Yeah, just over here. That blew up, that really put Homer on the map. Made him the artist he is today. And he's still doing so well. It's good when people from your hood are doing well, you know what I'm saying? Get a career in music, coming from a place like this. It's like, you can't ask for anything better, you know what I'm saying, especially if you love music. I used to play football here as well. It's, um, it's, a, different, it's a different sort of cage, but obviously uh, there used to be something called Arsenal Kicks. A lot of people may remember that. It was like an like Arsenal sort of academy sort of thing for the oh, streets, okay. like to take people off the roads and stuff. So that basically used to be me. That's the... That's where I used to play football. Another place I used to play football. Basically everywhere I went, I used to play football, bro. But now it's like everywhere I go, I'm just trying to write some music now, bro. You know what I'm saying? Those kids over there was me around 10 years ago. You know what I'm saying? We're probably trying to make it, trying to make it out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Kicking ball, 
and in general, there are good level of football in uh, oh, in bro. In in Hamilton, bro, there's so much, so many ballers, bro. Like, I know a lot of people that 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 played football, and everyone's playing at a good level. That that when I was younger, in it, including myself, I used to play semi-pro in it. I used to play for Redbridge, I used to play for Ilford. Like I said, things in life happen, bro. Surrounding myself with some different people. I used to be around people that played football. Fell out of football a bit, but obviously now I'm back in it. Five aside, seven aside. You know, I just watch, I watch football as well. You get me, like, I just love football. But at the end of the day now, I'm really trying to focus on my music. Really, you get me? That's yeah. what I'm trying to do. But is it difficult to do music in London? It's, it is difficult because it's like, everything comes at a cost, isn't it? Unfortunately, like, I'm glad Obviously, AD Northside, shout out AD Northside. Without him, I don't think I could have been making music up until this day. So, he really put me onto music. Like, since I met him, it's like pure vibes. Like, he would say to me, Come studio, show me what you got. And he's introduced me to some people that he, he knows, like Supreme, shout out Supreme. From then, I've got like 50, no, nah, not 50, I've got like 40. Around 40, 40 songs in the bank now, you get me? Just waiting, trying to drop another song. Goal Clear's been out for like two weeks and a half, three weeks now. Doing all right. First drop, Graham Daly. Next drop, probably going to be Graham Daly again. Got some fire coming still, can't lie. Yes, bro, so... We're in Hackney Wick right now, not too far from Homerton. This is where everything goes down. Pirate Studios in the UK, London especially, Pirate Studios. It's where a lot of underground artists, they come to make their music because it's cheap. This is where I basically record all of my music, you know what I'm saying? I do it at my boy's yard as well. So that's in North London. But predominantly, I do it in places like pirate.com. And you see, if you know the hotspot, the hotspot, it's a big platform for freestyles and stuff. One day, hopefully, I'm on there, you get me? They do all of their um, freestyles in here. So they book a room in here, get their freestyles done. It's a big platform, a lot of big artists come to these studios. If you ask a lot of artists from London about Pirate, they've been Pirate, everyone's been Pirate, you get me? This is the standard studio that everyone goes to. There's a lot of nice studios. There's a lot of nice studios in London, though, which I wish we could go to, but we're in the ends right now, you get me? can go elsewhere like North London there's so many nice studios but predominantly this is where I be at you know what I'm saying it's where me and the boys be at yeah. so we're in Hackney Wick Hackney yes. Wick this is part of Hackney it's like the neighbour borough obviously Hackney's the borough but it's right next to Homerton isn't it like you get me it's like it took us what how long like five five to ten minutes to walk here bro like obviously um, if you look around there's that right next to that yeah, you get what I'm saying? really different. It's, it's really different, bro. So this, the, the graffiti is what made Hackney Wick popular for what it's known for, innit? It's like sort of hippie area, do you get me? But since the Olympics in 2012, which is now the stadium of West Ham, which is just over there, we're going to see in a second, renovated the whole area. So money was put into the area. So now that's why you see a lot of like new blocks, yeah, new, new block blocks. of flats. In Homerton, there's a lot of new blocks, but obviously there's so many old blocks. There's not many old blocks over here. But as you can see, yeah, man, it's different, bro. It's different, you know what I'm saying? I know in Paris, there's quite, there's a lot of graffiti in Paris, uh, isn't it? It depends where. I remember, but, uh, I've been to back Paris. Back in the day, back in the day more. Okay, okay, okay. Day, yeah, man, I need to come to Paris, man. I need to see my Algerian Akis. You get me, my Algerian brothers. You get me, once you see this, ZK100, you get me on Instagram, bro. Hit me up, man. All of my North Africans, big up, big up. There's Hackney Wick Station. Ah, okay. So obviously we was at Homerton earlier, Homerton mm -hmm. Station. Did we take uh, any shots at Homerton Station? It was closed, didn't it? It's typical yeah, yeah. in the end. For this reason, we didn't, uh, we didn't Right now in London, we're struggling, isn't it, bro? Yeah. There's no trains, there's no nothing, isn't it? <laughs> if they want you to drive, you have to pay a fortune, you get me? If you want to jump on a train, there's no trains. You get me? It makes no sense. I've had big problems with, with driving, bro. Big problems. They, with, took, they took my car. Ah. Uh. Yeah, bro. <laughs> they, don't, they don't trust me on the roads, bro. I don't drive normally, bro. Obviously, we got canals. Quite nice, isn't it? <laughs> and this is the West Ham Stadium. Yeah, this is West Ham Stadium. Obviously, it used to be the Olympic Stadium. Fuck West Ham, though. Arsenal, <laughs> innit? Arsenal all the way, top of the league. If you're not an Arsenal supporter, don't talk to me. Who do you support? PSG? 
I show you. Oh, 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 Leo, Leo, Leo! Well, like I said, it's back now, yeah. Like I said, it's doing it now, isn't it? Yeah, no, like I said, it's doing it for you guys still. But yeah, bro, you get me. This is where West Ham played. This is where I watched Ronaldo, where Ronaldo just signed for Manchester United. Yeah, man. No, no, bro, just a lot of graffiti. This is the ends, man. To finish, to finish the the video, my bro. Mm. Can you tell me your social medias to follow you? So my social media, ZK100, Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, you know what I'm saying? ZK100, that's ZK1HUNNA, you know what I'm saying? More music to come. Thank you for coming to my ends, bro. Thank, thank you too. You know what I'm saying? Too. Show you around my ends a bit. This is where I'm from, this is where we grew up. Obviously, it's not the best, but we make, we make do with what we have in it, you know what I'm saying? Now, on to bigger and better things. I hit 10k, go clear on my Spotify. New music out soon, bro. You know what I'm saying, bro? Thank, thank you very you, much. It was a pleasure. It, Look in the mirror, what I become. Pushing away, I'm not up in the gym. They had the loaf, I had the crumbs. First thing morning, Nokia ring. 3525, top shot, can't lie. It would always fly, prof, come back nice. Like a sim and a Nokia device. All that was needed when things went right.